you can modify the circuit itself, you can program, everything is customizable. It's, I don't know, it's brilliant. Uh, it's a satellite in the shape of a can, and we get to build, like, we get to put things like wind speed and temperature and calculate how fast it's traveling, and we're gonna launch it up in a rocket. I can show you a, a can sat on a table hooked up to a computer and say this is the humidity in this room and I can also show you uh, data that we've gotten uh, after it's come down from uh, after it's come down and we're reading it off of that and say this is where it used to be but to be able to show someone a computer sc screen that has a live reading of what's happening around this satellite in space at that very moment is really powerful the process that scientists go through and, and learning what it takes to engineer and put together something and think about things for more than just, oh, I'm gonna do this assignment because my teacher told me to. I think they're really gonna get excited about it and I think they're gonna have a gr great time with the hands-on. I think they're gonna tell other kids about it and they're gonna be wanting to share their experience and it's gonna be something they're gonna remember forever. I think we're falling behind with a lot of other countries in math and, and reading scores and, and science as well. So I think STEM is a movement to compete again with the rest of the world um, with the latest technology and kind of get away from this sage on the stage, I teach you, to let's learn together and let's discover together.